The personnel who serve under the UN flag do so in some of the most difficult and inhospitable areas on earth, where they face instability, disease, and violence on a daily basis. Female blue helmets, human rights monitors, and other mission staff offer new skills and styles of functioning in the ever-evolving field of peacekeeping. Often, they can better communicate with local women, generating a greater sense of security while serving as an example of women's empowerment. كثيرا ما تجيء هذه الجهود بتكلفة باهظة على حساب أرواح حفظت حفظت السلام أنفسهم. ففي عام 2008 لقي 132 من حفظة السلام حتفهم أثناء أدائهم لواجباتهم وهذا أكبر رقم حدث في عام واحد في تاريخ حفظ السلام بالأمم المتحدة وسواء كانوا قد راحوا ضحية العنف أو المرض أو الحوادث فقد ترك كل, منه كل منهم تراثا هاما there are still relatively low percentages of female officers, both in the police and military services. I wish to appeal to the contributing countries to always consider a bare percentage of females for service in the peacekeeping missions. This not only inspires the host countries' women to join the police and the military in, the peace, in their countries, but can also help in cultures where sexual offenses like rape go unreported.